Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Ebony, where we're all things nursing, cooking, and lifestyle. If you're new to my channel, hey boo hey, and if you like this video or any of my other videos, please don't hesitate to subscribe, like, and tell a friend. So as you can tell by the title, we are going to be reviving this old crusty curly wig with just using a few simple items that I got right from the beauty supply store. Very inexpensive, so let's just get into it. So you want to start with some boiling water, um, get it boiled, and we're going to add in some silicone mix. I think I got it for like $7. Some conditioner of your choice. I'm using Aussie Moist um, and also some oil. You'll see me put in some oil, and I think that is from Miss uh, Aunt Jackie's Soft All Over. After you put all of your ingredients in, just give that water a nice stir before you put your wig in. And once we put the wig in, we're just going to let it sit in there for maybe 30 minutes. And then we will take it out and continue with the next steps. guys so it's been 30 minutes now we are about to wash and condition our wig and excuse my braids honey I had to give me a good braid down for my you know my wig to put on but anyway we're just rinsing out what we just you know soaked our wig in we're gonna wash it and condition it and we will detangle right after that So now our wig is all washed and conditioned. That's what you see on the wig. That white stuff is conditioner. And that's just going to help with the detangling process, which you're going to see me do in a second. So I'm just, you know, brushing it out with my dimming brush, just trying to get through all those kinks. Once I have brushed through the whole wig, I'm going to flip the wig inside out just so that I can focus on the knots. So what I'm doing is just taking small sections, adding some conditioner and some water, spraying it down and just combing from the end to the top of the roots, just like you would do your natural hair. So it takes a minute, but it's going to get it done.
are finally finished detangling. I cut through a lot of that detangling. It really did take a long time, but just look at the results. So all I did was finish detangling. I rinsed out the conditioner and now I just let it air dry for about 30 minutes and there's nothing on the hair right now. So what I'm gonna do is, the hair is still a little damp, so what I'm about to do is put in some leave-in conditioner overnight, let the hair finish drying and then I will install it in the morning. So I'm just using the Lotta Body Coconut and Shea Butter leave-in conditioner. It just really does really well on this wig. This wig, I really like using it on my wig. And yeah, I'm just gonna leave it overnight and we will install it in the morning. just want y'all to see how amazing God is look at that right there from beginning to right there with only leaving conditioner in it and y'all just wait until the morning honey amazing So that is all for this video. You just see me kind of fixing the wig and everything like that, just to my liking. But this is the final look. I really enjoyed the way it came out. Um, so yeah, don't buy a new wig, honey. You can restore it. So that's all I have to say, and I hope to see y'all in my next video.